Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and we are going to take a look at a setting in Windows 11 that might make a difference between you can uh, connect to some devices that are the computers on your network or not and can also make your computer safer especially if you go on public Wi-Fi connections. It's a setting that not a lot of people actually know about, but it is set by default to public in general. So what does that mean? So you simply go to your uh, start menu, right click and go into the settings app. On the left side, you will see network and internet and here click your Wi-Fi connection. Here you will see, of course, they're connected to Wi-Fi, but you will see on the second line your connection where you are and should be connected and secured, as it says here. But when you open this, you have, of course, a different type of profile. Notice that your connection could be either set to public, which is recommended, or private which is a different setting and I'll explain why you might want to be on one or the other. I am on private and I'll explain you why. It's simply because public is yes recommended for most people probably the best setting but it has one thing that it does to keep you safe is lock down the network capabilities of Windows. So in Windows 11, if you're on public, and the chances are you are because by default going to a new version of Windows, Microsoft usually puts the slider to public. That means that your computers are not discoverable on a network, for example. So if you have only one PC uh, and you go to public Wi-Fi with it and so on, it's fine. Public is where you should be. And like I said, if you have only one computer, and nothing else. Public is definitely where you want to be on this setting. That means anywhere you go, anywhere you connect, your PC is hard to discover because it's kind of locked down on the network. Private opens up the network. Private means that you are connected to some connection that you know is going to be fine and secure for you. You will usually use private when you're at home because at home you usually can control and know what computers are connected to your network, your home network. Why would you be private at home if you have more than one PC and want to share files between PCs, want to share devices? So you might have some smart devices at home that need to be connected to your computer. In order for that to work, sometimes you need to have your computer discoverable on the network. So that means you need to actually switch to private network where computers are now going to be visible and easy to connect with each other within your home network. So here I have a lot, you know, I have several PCs and I have a lot of devices that need to actually see my computer for control. So I have to set my computer at private so that it is discoverable on the network and easy to connect to. But I do that in my home with only my computers and my devices. So I have control and know what devices are on my network. You should never be on a private setting when you are on a public Wi-Fi because you open up your computer to possible attacks. Uh, if, you know, there are a lot of people in public Wi-Fis that are there just to try to sneak into PCs and, you know, put viruses, malware, or steal information data. So public is recommended for most people. Public is what you should be if you have only one PC, nothing else. Public is what you should be if you're in a public Wi-Fi situation. And private, really, just for your home and really just for your home devices at home. Uh, you should never be on private setting on public uh, Wi-Fi. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.